City, Florida, getting ready to go here. And I got my coffee. We're all set. We're going to Kissimmee and we're going to do a series of deliveries. One from Central Florida going up to Louisiana. Then we're going to go from Louisiana to Iowa. And then from Iowa to Louisville, Kentucky. And we have that all set up. It's kind of far in the future. I don't know if all that will pan out, but that's what we have set up. So let's get out of Polk City and go make our pickup here in Kissimmee, Florida. All right, driving. Save. And in December, when my uh, iPad is hooked up to my ECM, it will automatically put me on the driving line. But for now, I have to still put myself on that. Because the government wants to know that I'm driving. I've mentioned this before, I don't go to that Love's over there anymore, across the street. I go to this little Polk City Travel Center, because the fuel's like nine cents cheaper or something like that. And over there, you guys have been with me before, it's usually three or four deep of drivers all wanting to get in there and get out. Whereas this little one, there isn't anyone there. So, and the coffee's better. So, why not? I'm here to make a pickup. There's two stops on it. One's for, well, they're both for Louisiana. All right, looks good. We have one truck in front of us, and they're, uh, as soon as they're done loading, then we're gonna be next. So, that'll be good. We're loading for Louisiana, got two stops there. So, Let's wait. I got a new iPad mini and I'm going to be doing my logs on that and mounting it on there. Now that's the old Qualcomm mount, but the iPad mini works uh, fits perfectly on there. But I'm going to have to saw this off, this top part. So I bought a, a hacksaw to do that with. When Knight took their stuff out of here, they left that to me. The mechanic begged and pleaded for me to keep it because they had so many of those Qualcomm mounts there. So I did, and now it's a good thing that I uh, left it there because I can mount my iPad mini there. All right, I got this top piece off right here and now it's smooth now I gotta get this piece off this clip gotta get that off and then it should rest right down in there I might have to get rid of this piece too but we'll see I've started drinking V8 juice because I wasn't getting enough vitamins and stuff from vegetables so if you drink one of those cans a day, it gives you all the vegetables that you need for the day. So, it's a good way to do it. 
All right, this is the iPad mini holder. I'm not sure I'm going to have this on there, but it's going to be perfect if I do. So we are going to have to saw down this corner also. We got this one done and this one. Now we got to get this one done so that it's flush on there. Or I may just put Velcro on the back of here and stick it on there. I'm not really sure what I'm going to do. But we are going to have to get rid of that corner also. All right, uh, we got this perfectly smooth now. Right there, no gaps. It's completely flush. So now I'm just going to uh, put some Velcro on the back of this and it'll just ride right there, in theory. Now I got to get all this fiberglass dust out of here, or plastic, whatever it is. All right, there we go. It works good. It's going to stay there. It's going to ride nice. That's the tools I used, a hacksaw, scissors, and Velcro. A lot of people criticize the tools that I use, but I got just a simple Stanley hacksaw to cut that off and Velcro. So those of you that'll criticize, go ahead. But that's how I did it and it works good. So we're waiting for them to finish up here and then we'll get going to Louisiana. Well, we got loaded. In about an hour, right, right when I finished that uh, little project I did, they finished. So, it worked out good. Let's get her all locked up and we'll go get our paperwork. Good morning. I'm Bill. When I'm not moving trailers or at home building or fixing stuff, you can find me watching Adventures in Trucking with Indiana Jack. Stay tuned. <laughs> We're getting out of here. Beautiful setting this place is. Most places in Florida, when you get in the country like this, are a beautiful setting. Then when you get where the humans are, it's not so beautiful. You know what's right up the street from here, right? Some of you do. McLean. McLean Food Services. The only other company on the list with Nestle. Except the drivers. They're fine. The drivers are fine. It's only the uh, 15 hour unloading people. But we won't talk about them. We're going to have a nice drive in Florida this morning.
comes a nice KW. Looks just like the truck that I trained in, except 10 years older. Oh my, it's a swift truck. And I'm doing 66, so... He must not uh, have a governed truck at all. I wouldn't mind having a KW. And I even like that color, but I just don't like it that it says Swift on the side. We're almost to our final stop today. We only have 45 more miles to the loves up here at exit 70 here in Florida to Funniac Springs. Here we are. Yes, it's already five o'clock. We have a yield sign, which is good. deep in there. I'm glad we're not getting fuel. You guys were sleeping earlier and I got fuel at the Loves in Lee, Florida and it was three deep there too. flatbeds are going to get the good spots. Maybe not. It's a little harder to get out here in the mornings when there's trucks directly in front of us, but we'll make it. Well, after our little repair job this morning, the log held up well, so I'm gonna keep it there. And uh, now it has a home, so we don't have to worry about that. My next project, though, is I've got to hook it up the device through Bluetooth to the ECM, and we'll go through that another time, but that's going to be a little tricky because I have a Volvo, and Volvo doesn't make anything easy. So um, normal trucks, you just plug them into the, uh, to the plug, and it plugs right into the ECM, but not Volvo. It has, like three or four extra wires that I'm going to have to be plugging in. So we'll get into that some other time. I won't bore you with that. So we're here in Defuniac Springs.
Well, good night, everybody. Tomorrow's going to even be a better day than today was. I just know it. And tonight was a great day, so... Ha 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 ha!